Hey guys and welcome to another League of Legends video with Hados. Today I'm playing Senna, doing something a little bit different, doing like a commentary instead of actually uh, letting you know what's what's going on while I'm actually playing the game. This is just a replay, so I already know who's going to win, all team fights and all that. So we'll uh, see how we go with this commentary. If you prefer this over the the running commentary as I play through, let me know, and I'll keep this up. Obviously, this has a lot more features than uh, what I can normally show you. I can turn the fog of war off so we can see where all the enemy players are. We can uh, watch what the enemy team's doing. See vi vision that they have, uh, cooldowns, all that kind of stuff, which I don't actually have in game. So I might try and focus on center for most of it. But um, if there's any outplays or anything, I'll definitely switch to a different lane so that we can. We can see those happen. So we've got a pretty good team here. Fairly mixed damage, which is nice. Cannon and the Ari. Bit of AP. The Lee and the Kate. And the Senna, all AD. For my team. On the enemy team. Got the, the Nasus. She can build AP. The Sona obviously puts out a fair bit of damage. Uh, the Ramus, very annoying. As you see, comes in. Level 2 gank. Not great. Perfect timing by, by them. I flash. Absolute rookie move. I was 100% dead. So, um, yeah. There was, there was no need to flash there. So that seems I'm just walking back to lane, walk up to top lane, look at Cannon versus Nasus. So ranged matchup, Lee Sin ganking here. Oh Execution galore. Well done Lee. Well done, Cannon. Kate's getting poked out pretty hard here just by the the Sona here. Very annoying, but what can you do against the Sona there? Just do whatever we can to to get the farm that we can, and um, wait till wait till later in the game when Kate comes online. Siva highly annoying with the spell shield just to block damage. And get mana back. So I really need to keep an eye on that. While I was playing, probably didn't do that enough. Gave her a lot of free... Free spell shields. She was a little bit slow on that one. There's not much happening down in the bot lane, so... Head up to top. Cannon looks like he's just going to put some vision down. And back to lane. Lee Sin's invading. Taking some of Ramus's camps. Denying that experience. Trying to put him behind. Nasus looks like he wants to fight Cannon. Bad idea. Nasus is at a bit of a disadvantage in this matchup because Cannon is a ranged champion and Nasus is melee so Cannon can just harass him all the time back down to bot Kate's okay, not going too bad she's only had a 3 CS differential at the moment yeah, we got uh, a nice wave stacking up, but 
So does uh, Siva, and Siva's wave clear is just unbelievable. Ari oh, looks like she's roaming down. Lee Sin and Ramus are having a bit of a scuffle. Trying to get that extra movement speed boost. And Lee picks up the kill with an assist going to Kate and Senna. Ari vs Zed. Just a bit of farming. Zed is at a massive CS differential down the bottom. 13, 14 CS now and 15. So Ari's doing a really good job farming up there. Kennen got a 17 CS differential. We'll stay in top lane here because it looks like Buddy Ramus is coming up for a gank, but Kennen's got vision and he can just use that to uh, to escape. See Lee's coming up as well. Kennen ults. Lee coming in. Should pick up this kill on the Nasus. Nice. And that's a that's a two for none. Excellent. Top lane's really killing it this game, and the jungle. Lee seems being very proactive, which is nice. Back down to the bot lane where there is not much happening. It's just farming up, putting down a bit of bit of poke onto uh, onto the Sona. It's good ult. You're trying to block some damage out from the. From the Siva onto the uh, the Kate. The flash combo. I'm just uh, trying to pick up some waves here. <coughs> just gave her a free spell shield there. Probably did not need to flash that. But, uh, yeah, so, and I'm dead. I'm sure what this Ari was doing, she should have just turned onto the, onto the Sona there. But, um, in the end, they do pick up the kill, her and Lee, so... Lee donates it to Ari. Try and get her a little bit more ahead of the the Zed. See the Ari's picked up a Seeker's arm guard against the Zed. And the shutdown goes to Zed. Not the end of the world. Lee is uh, early game champ, and he can still has a, a lot of utility in the in the late game. He can kick the enemy carry into your team, and you can just burst them down. And this Ramus just pushed way too far here and paid for it with his life. Start the dragon up. Let's pick up some mist souls.
And Caitlyn comes in with the snipe on the Z. Picking up her first kill of the game, which is nice. Ari pushing mid while the Z is uh is dead. The enemy team does have a lot of vision around bot side. They got that one control ward there in the tri bush up top and then uh another one here. But Lee Ari trying to take on the Ramus but out out safely with her ult so Nothing to worry about there. It's Kate's in lane getting harassed by Sona big time. See, damage Sona puts out is just ridiculous for a support. It's it is crazy. Lee and Zed could run into each other. Lee definitely doesn't want to fight him right now. Cannon is just building up his CS lead in the top lane. He's got a nice wave. Good. It looks like he's just trying to freeze the wave here, which is very well played by Kennan. Just harassing the Nasus whenever he can, not missing any CS. Oh no. It's a two for none to the enemy team, the Zed. Zed is getting fed. Man, the cannon destroys the Nasus. The bot zone is just putting out some more damage. And we turn onto the Sivir. What I really need to do more of is try and bait out the spell shield out of Sivir. So that then I could use my uh, my stun onto her. She's spell shielded. Kate's ult there. Whiffed my ult, but uh, she ended up going down. And Sona picks up the Kate. Never going to catch the Sona there when she's got her uh, stupid movement speed buff on. Ah, oh, he's very low. Zed could definitely just combo her and she'd be dead for sure. But uh, he doesn't have ult up. Whether R is keeping track of that or not is another question. But uh, it's better to play a little bit safe. So it's just clearing out some vision. Pumping down the damage. Nasus has finally picked up some uh, magic resist to combat the cannon. But the way that the wave is, cannon's managing it beautifully. Oh, beautiful to watch. Ah, oh, I just missed that one. Boosted cannon, boosted sun. Decides to go for a little bit of 
a little bit of harass. So Ari's going to get pinched in here. This Ramus is definitely going to take her out. Fortunately for Lee, he got rid of the Nasus, but the Zed just stuck to him like glue. And Ara's on the run for her life. So Kevin feels he's, uh, he's pretty safe here. He's got a lot of escape tools. And he's got some vision. Just down here so he can see if anyone's coming upriver. I've got a nice ward here, the enemy team. Just tells them where Lee is, spots him out. Just gives them that little bit more uh, information. Oh, 1 HP feels bad, man. And this Siva is just starting to, uh, to run it down mid. She was not happy that Sona's picking up all the kills and not her. So she's just inting. 100% inting. Can't help Lee with the dragon here. Sona thinks she can come in and stop us, but just zone her off a little bit. Stuns me up. Not that I'm too worried because it's starting to put out a little bit of damage now as well. This cannon is just harassing this Nasus to no end. Ugh, it's only got 138 stacks. And that is... Uh, that's a dead center there. In comes Cannon with the TP. Cleans up the kill there on Zed and Lee picks up the Ramus. As you can see, this Siver is 100% just running it down mid big time. She wasn't playing bad at all. She just Got a B in her bonnet about Sona having more kills than her, and that was it. Just decided to ruin the game for her, for her team. This cannon in the top lane was was dominating, so it does make it hard, but. That just. Sona is just getting picked on by Lee now. Okay, it's there for a bit of backup. Dare say Ramus could have nearly 2v1 there. He's got a Bramble Vest, so the Kate Autos would have been uh, inflicting damage back on her. But he just decided to take the safer option. Sona disconnected, which we did not know about, but I, uh, I thought she'd come back. I think I only just hit that on Ari, and Zed disconnected, did not know about that one either. So the enemy team was having all sorts of problems here. All sorts of problems. And boosted. Decided to uh, stun the minions up instead. So 
Cannon looked like he was in a bit of trouble from the two on two fight with with the Nasus and the Ramus. And that was a hundred percent scumbag by me sniping that kill away from Lee. Hundred percent scumbag. But hey, he's got six kills, he doesn't need any more. So doesn't need any more. Just go ahead and take the Baron here. Very, very slow Baron. We are not chunking it out by any means. Pick up my mist rates. See, the enemy team has good vision. Or, well, not bad vision, I should say. As you can see, the Zed and the Sona must have reconnected. Hiding in here, hoping that someone would show up for a for a pick, but they have no one. Mm. Wow. And the Lee and myself just knocked down that uh Knock down that Siver. And Sona's in a bit of hurt here as well. I was trying to come in for an assist, but I just knocked it down too fast. Come over here and pick up our third dragon of the game. Infernal Rift. Some more mist wraiths. Cannon's just going to push bottom, try to get that bottom tower there with his Baron buff. Nas is pushing up top, getting a tower off with the, for the enemy team. But yeah, they can't match our push when we got Baron. Lee and myself are here. Not too worried, really. With my ult again. And I'll have a good game for ulting. Except that one where I scumbagged it from Lee. Knock down the mid tier one. We're going to push for the tier two. Tier two knocked down. And we'll just uh, shepherd this cannon minion so they can't kill it. But uh, Baron Buff just ran out. Ramus comes in. Good ult by Sona there, picking up two. But wasn't enough to get the kill onto the Kate. For the for the Zed, just got Lee kicked him back so he couldn't put down any more damage. And uh, just, yeah, comboed him to death. Siva running it down mid again. Nasus thinks he can 1v4, but way too far behind at this point. Yeah, we just push for the for the mid inhib turret here. I think we don't knock down the inhib here. I think we have to back off because they're all up and 
or nearly all up in that mid lane. So just back off, make the safe play, recall, and uh, pick up some items. So we go back, pick up a black cleaver for myself. Kate picks up a couple more daggers. Got Zed coming into our jungle here. Not sure what he was doing, he didn't place any vision or anything there. So just just coming for a walk. Thinks he's uh he's gonna take out the Ari. Goes for the flash. Cannon's just down bot pushing. Got Lee, Kate and myself here. Deciding to uh, to try and end the game. Sivir up the top is not doing much at all. Trying to push down turrets, but in this case she needs to be recalling because uh, we're just going to take the take the Nexus turrets here. <coughs> Lee puts down a bit of harass onto the Zed. Ends up smashing him. And we uh, we take out the game. So uh, yeah, Zed played reasonably well. Siva entered. She did not help her team at all, and we did end up reporting her for that. Um, feels bad for the enemy team. Like they did everything they could there. Doesn't look like they gave up, except the silver. But um, yeah, unfortunately, that's league. There are some people like that who just once they feel like they're gonna lose the game, they just don't care anymore and just do everything they can to to make sure that they do lose. All right, well, it's not a bad game on on center. I ended up. Five kills, four deaths, twelve assists. Lee and the cannon had absolute blinder of a game. Definitely helped our team get the win there. Uh, cannon absolutely dominated the Nasus at top. Zero six and one for the Nasus. Absolutely terrible. But uh, yeah, he was just just outmatched here. So thank you for watching. Subscribe, and until next time, later.